Hello everyone. In today's lecture, I'm going to solve a regional mathematical Olympiad problem of the year 2002. The question is find the real value of x for which it is satisfying the given equation. Now, in this lecture, I'm going to show you how to solve a RMO problem within two minutes. It's yes, it's possible to solve the question in two minutes. For that, you need some observation, and I'm going to give you a few tricks. So you have to watch the lecture till the end. Yes, you heard me right. We can solve this question within two minutes. Now I'm going to show you all the approach which is possible in this question and how to solve this with the right approach within two minutes. Now the first thing is, let's say I'm attempting this question in an exam and the first thing which I see is I can expand this because cubes are here. So let's say expanding will work or not, I don't know. See, see here, three terms are here and cube is here. Again, three terms are here and cube is here. So the outcome will be here you will go nuts here, obviously, because the number of terms you will be seeing in the exam is not comfortable. Okay. Now this idea will be rejected automatically. The second idea is we're going for hit and trial. Okay, here. But I don't think hit and trial will work because hit and trial will always work for trivial solution. Let's say x is equal to minus 1 is satisfying for a moment. But suppose if the solution turn out to be minus half, then you will not able to find the complete set. So this is also gone because if they say integer roots are there then we'll go for hit a trial now the third method is now i'm going to give you an observational approach for this kind of question you have to open your eyes and you have to observe now the third method is you have to observe here now i'm going to show you now let's say this number is equal to u here and this will be equal to u cube and let's say this number is equal to v here and this will be equal to v cube here now you have to observe here what is written on the right hand side so right hand side, if I add these two numbers, let's say u plus v, u plus v will be equal to, if you add here, you will get this as 3x square plus x and minus x will cancel out and you will get minus 3 here. Let's re-modify this and let's take 3 common here. So we'll get x square minus 1 multiplied by 3. The moment you take cube here, I think this number will become u plus v whole cube. That means we have to solve the equation u cube plus v cube is equal to u plus v whole cube so let's solve this and I'm going to erase this part here so if you open you will get this as u cube plus v cube is equal to u cube on the right hand side plus v cube plus 3 u v times u plus v I think u cube v cube will cancel out on both sides and remaining is u into v multiplied by u plus v is equal to 0 so from here, I'm getting three types of solutions here. Either u will be equal to 0 or v will be equal to 0 or u plus v will be equal to 0. Now in the end, what I'm going to do is I'm going to calculate the values of x from first, second and third. In the end, I'm going to take the union of all these three. So let's start. So as I said, either u will be equal to 0 or v will be equal to 0 or u plus v will be equal to 0. We got from the last slide. Now I'm going to equate u is equal to 0 that is x square plus x minus 2 is equal to 0 or 2x square minus x minus 1 is equal to 0 or x square minus 1 is equal to 0. Now I'm going to individually solve these equations. So from first equation I think I got the roots as minus 2 and 1. From second equation I'll get the equation I'll get the roots as x is equal to uh, you'll get this as 1 and minus half here. And from the third equation, you'll get this as x is equal to plus or minus 1 here. Now, in the end, I'm going to take the union of all these three, union of first, second, and third. So, in the end, our answer is x is equal to, you'll get plus or minus 1 here, minus 2, and minus half. So, this is our solution set. In total, we have four roots. So, that will be our final answer, and that will be all.